household expenses, buy land. Women, no doubt, are regarded as one of the most vulnerable groups in society, attributed most times to social inequalities, occasioned by religious, cultural, and other factors. Through the oversight visit. To bridge the gap of economic prosperity within this group in Ogun State, various initiatives have been put in place to address the obvious challenges, such as the launch of an empowerment program to improve their economic well-being. We are also dispersing to 12 groups. The Nigeria for Women Project launch is attended by the Chief of Staff to President Muhammadu Buhari, the World Bank Country Director, wife of the Speaker of the House of Representatives, First Lady from Southwest States, traditional rulers, among other dignitaries. More socioeconomic and political wherewithal for women. At the macro level, it will go a long way in reducing poverty in the family, reducing gender-based violence and abuse in the society, and further strengthening our economy. Therefore, empowering our women is not a favor to the agenda. It is, in fact, one of the most viable approaches towards achieving sustainable economic development. Beneficiaries drawn from the three senatorial districts of the state are presented with sewing machines, freezers, tricycles, grinding machines, and cash grants. The Minister of Women Affairs and the Country Director of the World Bank wrote the initiative. The beneficiaries from the three local government areas of Abu State, whose business plans have been approved, will start to receive payment today. The total number of beneficiaries are 4,517 beneficiaries, with Year One North local government having 1,213 beneficiaries. The Chief of Staff to the President, who represents him at this occasion, believes it fits in with the federal government's efforts to lift 100 million Nigerians out of poverty. The success of women is our success, and together we shall surely overcome all the challenges of development, the challenges of security, the challenges of unemployment, and the challenges of moving our country along to be one of the leading nations in the world in terms of equality for women, in terms of uh, shared prosperity, shared development, inclusive development in which the women uh, have to play a leading role. The event also witnesses the donation of five brand new buses to market women in the state.